Treble's going, she's gone. Weddings. Remembrance. Treble to two. National celebrations. Three to two, two lead. Or just another Sunday morning. Church bells convey many messages. Five to four. Two Ringing them four. brings many benefits. It's good for the brain. It's good for physical exercise as well. It's both physically and mentally a challenge because you've got to concentrate really hard. The sound comes a long time after the action and so listening is key. But this hobby is failing to chime with many. Like a lot of churches, Eddington Priory in Wiltshire is struggling to recruit the next generation. Youngsters don't see it as being a particularly cool thing. We've got 22 ringable bells in this big parish of uh, four churches, but we've only got 11 ringers that, uh, that are able to ring those bells. It's thought there are around 30,000 active bell ringers in the UK. Now that might sound like quite a few, but there are concerns as to how many there'll be in 10 or 20 years time. Well, during the First World War, when they'd gone off to So war, the aim of Ringing Remembers is to recruit 1,400 new ringers by well, Armistice Day of next war, year. That war, number's been chosen to honour the 1,400 bell ringers killed during World War I. This is the memorial book of church bell ringers who fell in the Great War. Alan Regan has been researching their lives and the impacts of their deaths. We can see one of the bell ringers from this very church. Indeed, so Leonard drew it. He was one of the six ringers from Eddington that died. There were six bells in those days. Six ringers died, so their, their band was gone. It's a national recruitment campaign funded by the Department for Communities and Local Government. But in Eddington, they're about to try a direct approach. Hi guys, yeah. sorry to bother you. Yeah. Um, don't suppose you would like to try your hand at bell ringing? So have you guys ever tried bell ringing before? I haven't, no. 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 Today, most bell ringers are getting on and if new people join now, they can be trained by these experienced, wonderful bell ringers and that will pass it on. Uh, will. Okay. That's it, don't look up, just keep looking straight ahead. It's a bit, bit complicated, you've got to keep looking, well you've got to keep your eyes straight and I keep wanting to look more up. On occasion, we need to go faster, or I can go slower by letting that rope slither through my fingers. I thought it'd be a lot harder, actually, and it's, it's not really. It's sort of just a fluid movement. Two new ringers shown the ropes. Many more wanted. Tim Muffet, BBC News, in Eddington, in Wiltshire.